Hi, Vinny Lavardi here, Technology Specialist for Enabling Devices. Today I'd like to talk to you about one of our product lines, the Communication Builders. We make these in a few different models. What we have here featured today is our most popular 7-level Communication Builder, our 7075 and 7075B. Just the difference is the colors. We also make them in a single level unit, the 7071 and 7071B. And we also have an on-the-go 7-level communicator, 7075G, which has an addition of a shoulder strap. We'll be using the blue one for our demonstration. This 7-level communicator comes with five different interchangeable frames. We have a, a one frame, a two frame, a four frame, an eight frame, and then shown on the device is a 16 message frame. You also have the addition of levels, and what that means is, if I'm using a 16 frame, I have a dial here on the back. We have a level dial from one through seven, a window setting, which goes over the different configurations I just showed you, your on and five control, a record button, and a microphone. So with the levels, you have seven levels. If I set my window frame to 16, I can make seven sets of 16 messages. So I can have a sheet for different topics. One could be food, one could be games, one could be songs, colors, shapes, and so on. The only thing you can't do with this unit is whatever frame choice you decide you want to work with, you must use that same choice for each of the seven levels in order for the messages to be retained and recorded properly. So an example is on level one, you have a 16 frame. If you want to go to level two now and change it to a four message frame, you can record those messages. But if you wanted to go back to level one on 16, those messages now would probably be jumped around or be in a different location. So again, you do have the levels, but you must use the same window frame for each level in order to use this properly. Here on the back, it takes four AA alkaline type batteries. Do not use any rechargeables or heavy duty type batteries. They do not have enough voltage to operate the communicator. So let me show you how we do a recording. The frames are held in under a spring loaded pin system. Just simply pull the frame out. Put your icons in here. If you're using Mayor Johnson's board maker, there are pre-made templates in their communication builder library under the name communication builder. Once you have your icon set up, you can, we recommend that you use a standard printer paper and then a light laminate is fine for durability. Uh, during usage, just have one icon sheet in at a time if you do store other sheets in here. Do not have them in during operation. The more material between that and the touchpad underneath here will make it harder for the user to activate the messages. And if you look at these frames here, one side is fatter than the other. This thicker side always is facing towards the speaker. If not, the icons will not line up properly. Drop the frame in from the top, push, and now your frame's inside. So let's go to the back to do our recordings. On the back here, we have the window setting on 16 to correspond with our front frame. I'm setting it to level one, volume's on. You depress the record button first, keep that held down. Then you're gonna speak into the microphone between six to eight inches in a normal tone of voice. And on the front here, while the record button is depressed, you'll press the location that you wanna make your recording for. Let me demonstrate. My name is Jimmy, what's yours? My name is Jimmy, what's yours? So you just press. My name is Jimmy, what's yours? Let me make some other recordings. I would like a chicken patty. I would like a chicken patty. Hamburger, spaghetti and meatballs. I'm thirsty, can I have a drink? Hamburger, spaghetti and meatballs. I'm thirsty, can I have a drink? Also, I want to make a note that the more message choices you have, the shorter the record time is. As you go with less messages, 
you have an increased amount of record time. On the 16 frame, you have roughly just under three seconds to make a recording. So one other important note I wanted to point out is when you look at the frame here underneath the touchpad, it's cut into 16 equal segments. When you are using different configurations other than the 16, say the four as we have here, when you set it to four windows, each pad in the quadrant will act as one. So basically, when you're using Two. a four message frame, when I make a recording, all of these pads in this section are going to play the same message, so it's going to act as if it's one message pad. Let me demonstrate. One, two, three, four. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four. Just keep note of that when you're making recordings. And again, these dividing lines can be dead spots if somebody has a very tiny finger. Or when you're making a recording, try to be on one of the pads when you make a recording. If you see here, if I hit dead on the spots, I will not get a message. One, one. And as I mentioned earlier, we do make these in a single level version, which is item number 7071 and 7071B. The only difference between those models and these is you will not have the levels. You will have a single level. So whenever you change out of frame, and you make a recording, when you move to another frame, you'll have to just record over the old messages. So you'll only be able to retain one frame set, no matter what it may be, a 1, 2, 4, 8, or 16. So there you have our brief overview of the 7-level Communication Builder series. Hope you enjoyed our video. Thanks for stopping by today. You can reach us at www.enablingdevices.com or through our 1-800 sales number, 1-800-832-8697.